Notre Dame sophomore foilist Axel Kiefel, Kiefer, <laughs> sorry Axel, um, returning from a, a very hot freshman year with uh, finishing third at NCAA's. What's kind of fueling your your drive and, and motivation for this season? Uh, yeah, well, as a team, Notre Dame, we obviously didn't finish well, so a big motivating factor is just realizing that we have more to accomplish as a team. You know, individually it was great uh, being able to finish top three, get on the podium as a freshman especially. But I'd say the bigger goal is just the team as a whole, and so that's what's pushing everyone this season. There's a lot of talk that the team could win the title this year. You guys are stacked in, in every weapon, both genders. What do you think stands in your way, apart from, of course, Columbia University? As in other schools or just what? Schools, um, yeah, schools or challenges. I mean, really, really open question. I, I'd say there's a lot of other strong schools other than Columbia. OSU is really solid. I think they're getting almost everyone back, and they have another women's Sabres this year. Um, Obstacle-wise, I'd say just our mental game. That's, that's what NCAAs is, who's the strongest team mentally. So really being able to put that together, um, not just yourself, but having all 12 fencers if we're to qualify all 12. You know, having everyone in sync, that's the, the key thing, I'd say. Talking about having people back, your sister, Lee Kiefer, two-time Olympian, is back. How, how special is that to be able to compete on the same team and potentially for a national title? It's great. I mean, I've grown up fencing her, obviously, so it's nothing new for me. But, it, I mean, it is nice and different fencing her at school, and, and I think it's a big relief for a lot of people who might be nervous knowing that Lee's there and it's just a nice, you know, safety cushion. If people aren't fencing well, it's nice to know that Lee will most likely pull out a lot of tough bouts. So, as as for you and your fencing this year, um, what what? How are you a different NCAA five touch bout fencer from the fencer you were last year? I think there's definitely a big learning curve that went on my freshman year, and that's still going on. Uh, just being, I wouldn't say there's one specific thing, but just taking it one touch at a time, knowing that every touch is very important, getting the endurance to be able to fence all those five touch bouts, uh, I think those are the biggest things. And I think that's uh, the biggest uh, issue I had last year at NCAA is endurance and you know, mental focus. Of course, it's a step-by-step -step process. What's the next step for you and Notre Dame? Next step, we have Notre Dame, our first weekend coming back from, or I mean, sorry, New York where we have NYU and St. John's first week back. And that's the super meet? Yeah, that's where we fence. That's our hardest meet of the year by far. So that's what everyone's preparing for right now. All right, well, best of luck with that, and uh, congrats on your top eight result today. Thank you.